Good evening. My name is Pastor Greg, one of the pastors here at Grace Lutheran Church, and I just need five minutes of your time. So it's Saturday evening, and tomorrow is Sunday, October 18th, and we are going to have our first in-person worship services uh, in quite some time. Uh, certainly the first ones we've had since the summer at all, but then uh, the first ones in the sanctuary since March. Um, it's been a while. <laughs> so I just wanted to make sure that everybody was clear on what we need to do in order to keep each other safe. So this video will be a quick overview of those things, and uh, I'm going to do them with you so that I know that they're not too tricky. <laughs> um, so here I am. I'm in my car. Welcome. Good to have you. Uh, since I'm here in the parking lot, that means I've already taken care of some things back at home. I don't have any of the COVID symptoms. I don't have a fever. I have already signed up to be here for worship, and I've got my mask, so I've signed up. I'm masking up currently, and I can show up for worship. So, with the mask on, I'm ready to go. I've parked near the door for this video's convenience. Now, this is one little obstacle I have that you will not. <laughs> we'll make sure the door is unlocked for you. So if you come in the building on the parking lot side, I'm going to ask that everybody do that. This is where you'll get your uh, mask if you don't already have one. This is where we'll make sure that you've signed up to be here for worship. And uh, it's going to be pretty obvious where to go next because we have these arrows on the floor. Head on up the stairs uh, or to use the elevator if you need to and make your way to the sanctuary. So as you're entering into the fellowship hall, you're gonna notice it's a little barren. We don't have any of our tables up right now. Don't have any of our chairs, maybe a few chairs. Uh, the scouts were using those, but they've sanitized them and they're off to the side, so they won't bother us and we won't bother them. It should be just fine. Back behind me, uh, you can see that's our former worship setup when we tried to do this back in the summer. We've learned since then, uh, not so worried about the contact transmission of the virus, so we can be in the sanctuary, and that's great. So we make our way through the narthex. Not quite as much air in here, so we'll try to make our way kind of quickly. And as we head into the sanctuary, it's about the same as you remember it. Uh, one of the only differences would be we've got the got the pews roped off here. We're just preserving social distance with those. And uh, we'll make our way to a few that I have picked out. And uh, that's it. You can see that when you do find a pew, you'll already have your bulletin sitting there waiting for you. Uh, let's see. The worship service is a little bit different than the last time you were here in the sanctuary. We, we're not going to be able to have communion. We won't be singing. There won't be music. But there will be the proclamation of the gospel. We're going to read scripture. We're going to pray together. We're just we're going to be together for worship, and that's going to be great. I'm really excited about that. Uh, I'll show you our, our little setup here. So we've got the uh, little stand for the camera and the microphone there. It's a little, a little crude, but it works for us. Works for us for now. So when worship is over, we're going to ask that you come out through the side rather than going back there. This we're just always trying to keep people away from cross traffic. So come out through this side door. Some of you know this door because I don't always get to shake everybody's hand. <laughs> uh, here, oh. Nope, don't hit a chair now. Got that table there. That's We'll have offering plates there. That's in case uh, you weren't able to give online or uh, through the mail. You can give it the plate here as well. Still prefer those online and um, mail-in options. So we're going to ask that you make your way to Oakland Avenue when you leave. Here is, uh, again, just one more way that we're not getting the cross traffic. Take a left and eventually you're going to find our parking lot. It's not very far at all. And that's it. So it's pretty simple. I'm looking forward to getting to see you tomorrow for those of you who will be joining us in person. For those of you who are joining us virtually, things are a little bit different tomorrow too because that's going to be 11 a.m. and then a uh, virtual coffee hour. 
uh, on Facebook at noon. So a little bit different, but definitely exciting, a great opportunity for us to share in gospel and to be together as a congregation in these tricky times. I would ask that you all pray that those who are sick would be made well, and I hope you get some great rest tonight, and I look forward to seeing you again soon. Thanks.